Hi everyone, uh, I'm David Cummins, I'm one of the NICU registrars, I'm the Education Fellow for RMH, so you probably know me quite well. Um, today we're talking about pneumothorax, um, specifically tension pneumothorax, and it's something that we encounter quite a lot in our, um, in our population. Um, and needle decompression we're going to demonstrate today, and it's very important um, to know how to set it up and to know uh, where to insert it in the baby. Um, so you really will see an improvement very fast in your baby once you have um, performed this procedure. So we, as you can see we only need four pieces of equipment. We have our cleaning fluid which should be appropriate for the gestation of the baby. We have our butterfly um, and we, we have a green butterfly because we have a term baby today, um, but in a preterm baby you would probably use a blue butterfly, which is smaller. A 10 mil syringe and a three way tap. So, if you take your butterfly and you connect it to the three way tap and just secure it. Take the 10 mil syringe attach to the top and make sure that it's closed off to the atmosphere. Now we're ready to decompress the pneumothorax. So now we're ready to decompress the pneumothorax. Okay, so identify your landmarks for a needle decompression. It's the mid clavicular line second intercostal space which is usually just above the nipple line okay so clean the area with your appropriate cleaning fluid wait 30 seconds your assistant is holding the arms identify your landmarks mid clavicular line second intercostal space and straight down aspirating as you go until you hit the air pocket once you reach 10 mils you can open to the atmosphere Discard your air. Open to baby and continue to drain until you've completely drained all of the air, at which point you will meet resistance.